Well, you know, m m both of my boys play the piano, and they're getting better and better at it. They haven't achieved this stature yet, <laughs> but they haven't gotten close to Carnegie Hall like you have, or people like Quincy Jones influencing your life. But you also do a little musical improv at home to keep her skills sharp, which I thought was wonderful. Can you give us a little example of how that goes, and maybe we can play along? Are you ready? Can you ready to do a little musical improv, classical musical okay. improv? Well, um, actually, the um, she did every style. Um, when um, it's not boring at home, it's, but the song that she played for you earlier was when I was making taco dinner. So uh -oh. uh, you never know when these songs pop out, and she composes them. But okay. we definitely have fun. So if you can use any expression, or phrase, or a color or words or um, a scene and she can compose and we just we can well, give us an it. example you ready okay for Mother's Day how about um, okay a boy that's been at way at college for many many months maybe overseas and he's seeing his mother for the first time and his mother's seeing him and he has bouquet of flowers for her and they're running slowly towards each other Wow okay, here <laughs> we go. Take it away. <laughs> Yes, that's her favorite thing to do. Um, she writes for or orchestra. She just premiered a bunch of symphony pieces with orchestra. And her favorite thing in the world is scoring for films. Wow, She's got a lot on YouTube, though. Can I, John Williams, move over. Can we jump in on this? Because I don't want people at home to think that you guys do, that you, she knows. Do you mind if I give you my improv yeah, idea? Sure. Okay, look, she's like, sure, what's coming? <laughs> we've, not, we've not talked about this, but okay, so we're both from the Midwest. Okay. And I have a very vivid vision of that storm front coming in where the tornado warnings are out and the sirens are going and everybody is like hunkering down because you see the black clouds coming over the horizon and the winds are starting to pick up. Okay. Can you take that? Here we go, let's see. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Okay, how about kids at a birthday party? It's going to be a surprise. Um, they've got the little girl blindfolded, and she's going to take it off, and she's not going to believe what she so sees. So from the it's little like, girl's perspective? From the little girl's perspective. Oh, so she's... Leading up to it. I'm making, do you have one? Uh, well, the, the last one says, Dad, we're going to take it from the oh. card there, right? And Dad, no, no. Well, no. Do you have an improv? Do you, uh, do you no, have no. one you want to try from her? Yeah. Yeah, all right. the first time that I took my, I, I have seven children, and every time at two years old, I took them to Disneyland for the first time, and I watched the expression on their face when they saw, when they went into It's a Small World, just their little expression. Have you been to Disney have you World been? or Disney? I've been to Disney World a couple times. Okay, so it's the first time I ever took them through this little magical little place. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much, Emily. Diversity is